Humans are fascinated by megastructures. They represent a civilization that achieved the impossible. Have you ever wondered what Earth would look like if it had rings? Will Earth still be able to host life? This is an ideal question that arouses curiosity and will delve into what would really happen if Earth had rings like Saturn. The reigning queen of everything once said, if you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. Well, I like the Earth, but why wasn't a ring put on it? Our journey begins by understanding what makes Saturn's rings so iconic and then delving into the incredible changes these rings could bring to our home planet. Saturn is the sixth planet from the Sun and the second largest in the solar system after Jupiter. It is a gas giant with an average radius of about nine and a half times that of Earth. It is renowned for its magnificent ring system these rings are made up of countless particles of ice and rock, creating a celestial spectacle that has fascinated astronomers for centuries. These rings are not only visually stunning, but also a testament to the wonders of our universe. There are two main hypotheses regarding the origin of the rings. One hypothesis is that the rings are remnants of a destroyed moon of Saturn, for which a research team at MIT has proposed the name Chrysalis. The second hypothesis is that the rings are left over from the original nebular material from which Saturn was formed. Now these may seem a bit complex, but do not be dismayed by the names, after all, we are just in for the knowledge, right? Some ice in the ring comes from Saturn's moon and Enceladus's geysers. The water abundance of the rings varies radially. This abundance variance may be explained by meteor bombardment. Some of the moons of Saturn, including Pandora and Prometheus, act as shepherd moons to confine the rings and prevent them from spreading out. Just recently, astronomers reported studies suggesting that the rings of Saturn may have resulted from the collision of two moons a few hundred million years ago. What if this happened to Earth? Would we be able to survive it? Mother Earth, as some naturalists would fondly call her, is the third planet from the Sun and the only astronomical object known to harbor life. This is enabled by Earth being a water world, the only one in the solar system sustaining liquid surface water. Most of Earth's land is somewhat humid and covered by vegetation, while large sheets of ice at Earth's polar deserts retain more water than Earth's groundwater, lakes, rivers, and atmospheric water combined. Now picture Earth, with rings stretching across our sky, casting intricate patterns of shadow and light. This transformation would usher in a new era of wonder and discovery. To better understand how this transformation would unfold, let's explore the science behind it. The birth of Earth's rings would begin with the collision and breakup of a celestial object, much like what scientists believe happened with Saturn's rings. Fragments from this collision would form a new ring system around our planet. These rings would consist of various materials, including dust, ice, and rocks. Their composition would create breathtaking colors, ranging from pristine whites to vibrant blue marses and purples. The presence of rings would have profound effects on Earth's environment, climate, and culture. Without Earth, the rings would lose what's holding them together. The battle to save our planet. The rings are here to stay. One of the most striking changes would be the way we experience our days and nights. As the sun passes behind the rings, a phenomenon known as ring shine would occur, casting enchanting shadows on the surface. This unique spectacle would inspire artists, poets, and dreamers, shaping our cultural expressions and storytelling. The most stable place for rings will be around Earth's equator, so the appearance of the rings would vary by latitude. 
For instance, near the equator at Quito, Ecuador, you would see the rings from the inner edge on, so they would look like a thin line rising straight up from the horizon. In comparison, near the Arctic Circle, the rings might look like a hump on the horizon, and at more temperate latitudes, the rings would look like a giant arch, crossing from one end of the sky to the other. But Earth's rings would also have significant impacts on our climate and weather patterns. The ring's gravitational interactions with our planet would influence ocean tides, atmospheric circulation, and even precipitation. Scientists would embark on a new era of climate research, striving to understand and predict the effects of these rings. Earth's hypothetical rings would differ in one key way from Saturn's, they wouldn't have ice. Earth lies much closer to the Sun than Saturn does, so radiation from our star would cause any ice in Earth's rings to sublime away. One surprising benefit of Earth's rings, if there ever would be, is their protective role. Like Saturn's rings, they would act as a cosmic shield, intercepting and disintegrating potentially hazardous space debris before it reached the surface. This protective feature would reduce the risk of asteroid impacts and safeguard our planet and its inhabitants. It would also create unique ecological niches. Some plants and creatures would adapt to the 11 changed light conditions, evolving to thrive in the alternating periods of ring shadow and ring shine. Scientists and nature enthusiasts would embark on expeditions to explore these ecological changes, unlocking new insights into life's resilience and adaptability. With Earth's rings above, our fascination with space exploration would intensify. Space agencies worldwide would launch missions to study our own ring system, seeking answers to the mysteries of the cosmos. These missions would inspire the next generation of scientists and explorers, fueling our curiosity about the universe. The transformation of Earth into a ring planet would unite nations in a shared fascination with our celestial adornment. International collaborations on space research, conservation efforts, and cosmic diplomacy would flourish. History will not be kind to Randolph. The fight to protect Earth's rings. From protecting the rings from space debris to preserving their unique ecosystems, our united efforts would teach us the importance of safeguarding the treasures of our universe. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please click on the subscribe button and hit the notification icon to turn on post notifications so you won't miss more videos. It's possible that Earth already possessed a ring. Our planet was born about 4.5 billion years ago, and previous research suggests the moon arose a short time later. The prevailing explanation for the moon's origin is that it resulted from the collision of two protoplanets, or embryonic worlds. One of those was the newborn Earth, and the other was a Mars-sized rock called Thea, named after the mother of the moon in Greek mythology. The impact would have generated a ring of debris around Earth that eventually coalesced into the moon. In essence, although the vision of a ringed Earth might seem like a fantasy, it might have once, for a moment in time, been true. As we conclude our cosmic exploration, we're left with a profound sense of awe and wonder. The what-if scenario of Earth with rings like Saturn invites us to dream, to reach for the stars, and to protect the fragile jewel that is our planet. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us reach more people with our content. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more updates.